What's going on, Bears fans? So I've been hearing a lot of craziness talking about, you know, moving on from Justin Fields and drafting one of these other quarterbacks at number one and trading Justin Fields. It's it's crazy. Justin Fields just had um, he had a, a, a really good season, you know, and he definitely needs help on the offensive line and the defensive line and and could, could, could use some more help at receiver as well but he played his heart out he balled out he he was electrifying he was the most exciting player in the nfl this season and people want to move on from him i mean he's six foot three 230 pounds he's he runs a, a four 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 forty. that's what he clocked that at the the combine and I mean it's pro day but he's actually faster than that on the field and it's you people want to move on from him for any of these quarterbacks coming out of this this draft it's it's baffling to me I just I just don't get it it makes no sense to me I don't understand why or how anybody could really could really see that I'm like I, I just don't understand uh you, you, you think that these players, these young rookies that's coming in, I think, granted, that they're going to be, he's in his, he just finished his second season, his first time as a full-time starter, and you want to bring in a rookie who has not started in the NFL, and these guys are smaller, you know, some of the guys um, who, who people are talking about play with, playing in a, in a lesser conference, so they're not playing against the same type of competition that he played against, and I mean, it's it's just baffling to me. Um, the now I don't know what the Bears are gonna do, but I believe they're gonna keep Justin Fields. They're gonna trade down and they're gonna acquire more picks so that they can fill some of the holes that they need to fill because they do have a lot of holes that they need to fill. That's why Poles gave away. Uh, I mean, that's why he made so many one year contracts because he knew he was gonna fill other holes when he had more cap this season. No, he didn't know he was going to have the first pick of the draft, but that allows him to get more draft capital. I'm going to see what he said at his press conference today. So, um, bread out forever. And um, listen, you know, I'm tired of this crazy talk, you know, but <laughs> hey, it is what it is. People are going to say what they want to say, believe what they want to believe. And once the season ends, the speculation starts. So I expect to hear some crazy questions at the press conference, but bread out forever. We're going to be here forever. Love y'all, and I'm out.